You see, I was working at Tele... Tele... How do you say it? Tele... Telemundo. Telemundo. <laughs> yes. Wait, you might remember me. I was dubbing movies at the time. You might remember me as the voice of Curly in Spanish. Huh? No, 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 no. vergüenza, eh? No. Well. Yvonne comes down to the studio to see what goes on behind the scenes. Well, no sooner are we alone than my slight hint of masculinity whips her into insensate desire. And being the occasional heterosexual that I am, I allowed her to have her way with me. But whilst our anatomies were coinciding, I could not stop thinking. I could not stop thinking. You see, my life, it really has no purpose, no aim, no particular direction that I'm aware of. I'm in complete self-denial, and yet I'm truly happy. I don't get it. What am I doing right? And I looked down, and I had lost the will. You know what I'm talking about, right? Well, I knew you would. So I faked an orgasm. <laughs> oh yes, I had never done this before in my life. But it's really quite simple. I flipped it over in her front, I moaned and carried on, oh, oh, <laughs> pulled out and spat on her back. <laughs> yes, I felt terrible. I felt terrible. It was the first false note in an otherwise flawless performance. <laughs> now, you that actor? Excuse me, sir, aren't you that famous bastard? Guilty as charged. Oh, God. God, I don't want to be with anyone whom I love more than myself. <laughs> Well, I'm not black, and I'm not white. What am I? I'm, I'm urine-colored. <laughs> I'm actually urine-colored. <laughs> <laughs>